seven on that one. My name is Enos A. Boyer, Jr. I live at 108 West Main Street. My only address is Hershey, Pennsylvania, but I live in the village of Union Deposit. Yes, I was born down about five houses down on the other side of the street at 117 West Main Street, February 23rd, 1929. Um, the way Union Deposit got its name <clears throat> was from the canal because it was called the Union Canal hence Union, and then uh, there were two warehouses in town. <clears throat> Down here on the West Canal, it, it, there's a brick building that says Citizens Band. That was a warehouse. And there was a warehouse uh, down from where the canal house is on the other side of the street. And the farmers uh, and merchants would uh, deposit their goods in there, or when they received goods, they would deposit them in there till they were picked up, so hence a union deposit. I'm not exactly sure how it got started, but I'm sure that uh, that terrible fire that uh, took place uh, was a big factor in uh, wanting them to start up a uh, fire company. And the building that uh, they used for their first fire truck uh, formerly was a schoolhouse. And the uh, bell from that uh, building is back at the uh, South and Over Elementary School now uh, on display. In fact, I made the uh, wooden cradle that it sits in a couple of years ago. Three houses down here. <clears throat> um, this was uh, after I got out of the Navy before I was married. Uh, the lady was using a, a gas stove. Uh, it was white gas, and they used to have to pump them, you know. <clears throat> Somehow, the thing flared up, and it was a kitchen fire. And when my dad and I came home, and we lived right across the street from it, the fire truck was parked there, and my dad said, Oh, my God, don't tell me my house is on fire. <laughs> and here was the house across the street. One of the most enjoyable things about belonging to a, a smaller company is that tight-knit group. It's a pretty good group of guys here, you know, I gotta say, uh, and, and ladies. Why I do it really is just to help out uh, my neighbors and my community. Um, I just, the thought that nags in, in the back of my mind is, you know, if one of my neighbors needs help, what if nobody, what if nobody came? If I wanted to know more about what to do in an emergency, I should join my local fire company, which is what I then did. <laughs> 